today we'll see one more problem on projection of uh, planes let us uh, let us take this problem a square lamina abcd of 40 mm sides on cor uh, on corner c such that the diagonal ac appears to be at 45 degree to vp the two sides bc and cd containing the corner makes equal inclinations with hp Draw the surface of the lamina makes 30 degree with hp draw its uh, top and front view so this is the given problem so in this problem it says that it's a square lamina abcd of sides 40 mm and is saying resting on uh, it rest on corner c corner c is resting on hp such that the diagonal ap appears to be inclined at 45 degree to vp that condition is given and two sides so bc and cd containing the corner make equal inclination with hp fine the surface of the lamina makes 30 degree with hp draw, draw its uh, top and front view so this is the given problem let us see how to draw how to solve this problem so first let us draw xy line and uh, mark vp uh, hp and xy line say so this is my uh, select a line and uh, select a, a thin line so mark x and y go to tax and there should be times in the row and uh, bond size is 3.50 so this is my x and uh, this is my y and this is my vp and this is my hp let us rearrange the terms properly so this is x and uh, this is y this is uh, VP and uh, this is HP. Let us use uh, capital letters. Say I use caps letters, say VP, HP. So I go to text and uh, this is uh, my VP and this is my HP. So, and we are in the terms properly. Say this is uh, vertical plane and this is horizontal plane. Saying resting on HP with one of its corner and is a square line so now let us construct a square say just uh, select a comma and a rectangle try to construct uh, a rectangle or square so now go for dimensions it is visible so i'll change the dimension i'll change the thickness as so a 0 0.50 so let us go to dimensions so go to small dimensions and uh, this is uh, uh, this is 40 enter and it's also 40 is a square so it's also 40 so let us see the 40 yeah this is 40 so now rotate this one because corner is resting on hp now I rotate this uh, square of 40 by 40. let us select the complete uh, square and uh, go to rotate I have a rotate option switch off this copy now copy switched off now select the element to rotate so i'm rotating this one i'm rotating this one for the inclination, the inclination is uh, 45 degree. We need to rotate at an angle of 45 degree. Let us draw 45 degree. 45 degree and end Now, I'll rearrange the term properly. So just I move this. I'll keep it somewhere like this. I'll keep the lamina like this, uh, square like this. So we need to switch up the copy. So go to move and select the element to move. First select the elements to move and I'm moving this one. So go to move option, switch up this copy and I place it somewhere. Okay. So now let us draw let us draw front view. This is the top view. Let us go for naming. So in the problem is clearly mentioned corner C. Uh, rest on corner C. So I'll, I'll take this is corner C and this is A. Then uh, A C will be the diagonal. It appears to be at 45 degree to BP. So now go for text. Go to text, time zero. And uh, this is my corner uh, C. This is my corner B. This is my corner A. And this is my corner B. So rearrange the terms properly. Let's take this a corner C. And uh, this is uh, my corner B. This is my corner A, and this is my corner B. This is my corner B. So now uh, we need to draw the front view. So I will draw the front view. So go to line and select a thin line from corner A. Draw vertical projection line from corner B. 
draw vertical projection line that will intersect x y line from corner c draw vertical projection line that will intersect similarly from corner d draw vertical projection line so that will intersect x y line anyhow the projection line from d and b are uh, overlapping or points are fine so let us draw the front view in the first position select a line and line thickness is 0.50 mm so from here to here in from here to here now go for naming so naming is uh, this one i'll call it as c dash so this is my uh, c dash this is my d dash of b dash because d is visible and b is not visible so this one i'll call it as uh, d dash of d dash of uh, b dash and you see it's my a dash my a dash so here in the terms properly so this is my a dash this is my a d dash of b dash and this is my uh, this is my sc dash so i completed the front view i completed the first position of the square lamina so now go to the second portion in the second portion it says that the surface of the lamina makes 30 degree with hp now i'll show the inclination with respect to hp so now go to more option and just switch on the copy and uh, i'll select this front view i select this front view I place it somewhere here at the appropriate distance. I place this one now. Go to rotate, go to rotate. I'm rotating this one, so this is my center of the rotation. I'm rotating this element, so the inclination is given 30 degree with HP is given. So, rotational angle is 30 degree. Your center 30 degree. Copy should be off. Now I can measure the angle. So go to angle between, measure this and this. It should be 30 degree. Now draw the vertical downward projection line. So to get the top view in the second position. So from C dash, I draw vertical downward projection line. From A dash, I draw vertical downward projection line. From B dash of D dash of B dash, I'll draw vertical downward projection line. So now from A dash, from A to A dash, I draw projection line. From uh, B to B dash, draw the projection line. From uh, C to C dash, I draw projection line. From D to D dash, I draw the projection line. Now join all intersection points. So go to line and select the thickness 0 0.50. C A A dash, then B B dash, then uh, C C dash. This is my C C dash, C C dash, and D D dash, D D dash, and A A dash. A dash. Now go for naming. This is as uh, this is A, corner A. This is my B, this is my C, this is my D. So arrange the terms properly. Yeah, this is uh, corner A, this is uh, corner B, this is uh, corner C, this is corner D. Now remove the unwanted lines. So go to trim, and I don't want these extra, extra, extra lines. Just trim it. So I completed the second position. Now go to the third position. So in the third position, it says that uh, the diagonal AC. So AC is the, this is the diagonal line. So this is the diagonal line. So this diagonal line, AC is the diagonal line. So this diagonal line is uh, appears to be 45 degree to VP. So now let us uh, draw this diagonal line. So now I'll go to I'll draw 45 degree inclination line. Go to line, select the thin line. So just draw 45 degree inclination line. So this inclination angle is 45 degree angle between this and this is 45 degree maybe 45 degree this is 45 degree this 45 degree inclination line so now 
make AC uh, should be inclined at an angle of 45 degree. That is AC appears to be 45 degree to VP. So now I'll go to more option. I'll go to more option. Copy should be on. Select the element to move. I am selecting this complete uh, square along with the diagonal. We need to pick diagonal also. So at first, let us draw the diagonal line here, AC. This is AC diagonal line. So now go to more option. Copy should be on. Select this complete uh, element, complete uh, square, and uh, select corner A. Place corner A somewhere here. Place corner A somewhere. Uh, somewhere here. And uh, go to rotate. Select this complete element. Select this complete element along with uh, text. So go to rotate. Copy should be off. I'm rotating from corner A. Corner C will be the radius like this. I'll place AC on 45 degree inclination line like that. So now draw the vertical projection line. So now select the line from A dash. I draw projection line, horizontal projection line from uh, B dash, B dash of uh, B dash of B dash, I draw projection line from C dash, draw projection line. So now from A, so this is my A, and here A dash is here. So till here you draw the projection line from B. This is my B, from B to B dash, draw the vertical projection line. From C, C dash. So this is uh, my C and C dash is here, somewhere here. Should be vertical projection line, 90 degree line. Then from D, this is my D and uh, D dash is somewhere here. Should be a vertical projection line. Then from A, A dash is a vertical projection line. Now go to line, now I'll complete the front view. Go to line. And thickness is 0 0.50 CR. Uh, this is A, A dash and uh, B, B dash and uh, C, C dash projection line. Then uh, D, D dash. Then A, A dash. Okay. So now go for naming. Go to text. A dash. I'll make it B dash, and I'll make it C dash, I'll make it uh, D dash. Now this is uh, my A dash, this is my B dash, this is my uh, C dash, this is my uh, D dash. So that's complete this problem. So let us remove the unwanted uh, extra lines. I don't want these extra lines. So this is uh, square lamina A B C D. 40 mm side rest on on on, on corner C such that the diagonal AC appears to be at 45 degree to VP. And surface of the lamina meets 30 degree with HP. So this is the final portion of the square lamina. So this is the front view and this is the top view. So with this I will come I will complete this uh, problem. Thank you, thank you so much.